Welcome to this goddamn brawl of a debate. Tonight, we got Richard Tater here, ready to spew his bullshit about President Trump. So Richard, what the fuck's your take on that orange-haired cocksucker? Well, hold on to your goddamn hats, Elmer, cause I'm about to lay it out straight. Trump may have been a real son of a bitch, but he sure as hell shook shit up where it mattered. His economic fuckery put some real dough in folks' pockets, and he didn't take no goddamn shit from nobody, especially them terrorist assholes. Fuck me sideways, Richard. Let's not sugarcoat this pig's ass rodeo. Trump's bark was louder than his dick. And them tax cuts? They lined the pockets of his rich fuck buddies while the rest of us were left scratching for goddamn scraps. And don't even get me started on his foreign policy clusterfuck. Oh, shove it up your ass, Elmer. Trump may have ruffled a few feathers, but he kept the wolves at bay. His tough stance on China and them other fuckwads showed the world. We ain't nobody's goddamn bitch. Well, I'll be damned, Richard. You sure know how to jerk off a load of bullshit, but let's be real here. Trump's erratic behavior and Twitter tirades made us the laughingstock of the world. And his mishandling of the pandemic, that's a whole sack of batshit crazy. Listen here, you cunt nugget, ain't nobody perfect. Trump may have had his faults, but at least he didn't dance around the issues like them other pussy politicians. He spoke his mind for better or for worse. Fair enough, you prick. But let's not forget this ain't no goddamn circus. We're talking about the future of our country here, and we damn well better learn from the mistakes of the past. You're goddamn right, Elmer. So instead of bitching and moaning, let's grab our cocks and pussies and keep doing what we do best. Fuck ourselves. Thanks for tuning in. Stick around for more from Elmer's world.